The Mega Millions jackpot is now more than $1 billion. And as you can guess, people are lining up for tickets, hoping that their numbers are the right ones. CBS Philadelphia Montgomery County reporter Kim Hudson talked with some of those mega players who have their fingers crossed. Many people spending money on the lottery. North Town Food and Fuel has been busy lately. Last week, like it was too busy for the lottery mainly because we guys were working here, so one of the guys just focused on the lottery these days. That is because the Mega Millions jackpot is now worth more than a billion dollars. Lottery hopefuls lined up at the ticket counter ahead of Tuesday night's drawing. Usually, people talk about buying big houses or fast cars. We found people trying to put others first, like Burton Quinn. Take care of my church. Um, family, invest. Cesar Caraballo said his family would have nothing to worry about ever again. Not even my nieces or nephews. I'll make sure they all go to college, wherever. You want to go? To, where you want to go? You want to go to Harvard? Go ahead. Your uncle got it. Let's do this. 88 year old Lenora Estrada was thinking about her 62 year old son. This is him as a child. He lives with autism. He been to the Land City and Wildwood. And the Poconos, they get they get around. Believe me, <laughs> I plan to donate to Growth Horizon. The agency works with adults with intellectual and developmental disabilities in Horsham and Levittown. You know, they take him out for dinner. They, he's on, um, he do bowling. He goes to the gym. <clears throat> you know, stuff like that. So I mean, they do quite a bit for him. Estrada says if she wins, she will help Growth Horizons first. Then she'll do something for herself she'll go to the Bahamas. These dreams could come to life within just hours. The next drawing is tonight. We'll have the numbers for you on CBS News Philadelphia at 11. In Norristown, Kim Hudson, CBS News, Philadelphia.